Once again, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the 2018 Lee Swift Manassas Air Show. My name is Kevin Rischlick. I'm your co-air show chairman here along with Ann Rischlick, co-chairman of the air show. This is our seventh year putting on this great air show in Manassas. We want to thank all of you for coming and enjoying the air show with us today. So give yourself a big hand. We have aerobatic performances starting in 22 minutes. Between now and then, we're going to do a couple recognitions that are very important to the air show. It costs almost $100,000 to put on this air show, and we do it all through donations. We do it from very generous, generous folks with the love of aviation. And um, to highlight some of our top sponsors this year, we'd like to recognize a couple of wonderful folks. Uh, here to my uh, left, we have Khan, who's the CEO of uh, Lease Web. Uh, the, the best in web hosting. This is your second year as a 25k sponsor. Uh, he just came off that black L39 jet ride that you saw land as a sponsor ride. So that's what you get when you sponsor an air show. You get a ride in a fighter jet. So is, are your knees wobbling? Kind of. Alright. So what we'd like to do to, is present to you this uh, wonderful certificate of appreciation as our title sponsor. We name it the Lease Web Manassas Air Show on behalf of the Manassas Regional Airport, the Manassas. Big thanks to Patriot High School, the marching, marching Pioneers Air Force this morning during the National Air Force Day, and of course, the Garfield High School Honor Guard walking out for us today. We thank them for coming out this weekend. I'd like to take a moment to describe unique history of what you're about to watch this afternoon. Back in 1997, the leaders of Air Combat Command assembled a select group of retired military and civilian performers to celebrate the 50th anniversary of the United States Air Force. In 2010, the Air Force Heritage Flight Foundation was joined by the United States Air Force to keep this popular program flying. From this gathering before the heritage flight, a visual representation of the Air Force history from the days of Army Air Force to the present. What started as a long time event has been a popular end event, and now, what is the between the Air Today, but right here, the World War II P31 Mustang is Andrew McKenna. In the 
Six Air Force F-22 Raptor being flown by Major Paul Lopez II, call sign Loco.
Air Force Daddy's flight. Now, we hope you have enjoyed watching and take pride in this rare display of more than 65 years of air power heritage. If you have any questions, please stop by or give these guys a call. You can talk to the Air Force anytime you want. This is Major Paul. Call sign Loco Lopez, the second flight for today. He's got more than 1,300 hours in jets. Fighter jets from Virginia Beach, Virginia. We want to thank his main his team, his Master Sergeant Jamie Fleming. His crew chiefs are Star Staff Sergeant Israel Davilia and Staff Sergeant Nicholas Baraducci up there. Now we've been able to work out this live by force heritage flight force safety because we're doing an air show also up in the Guire Air Force Base before the F-22 is doing a full demo for us. We talk a lot about to coming down and do the heritage flight force right here at Manassas. From the left one more time is your F-22 Raptor. Now to the trials, Major Paul Loco Lopez. and the Heritage Pass today. We thank them for doing that for us. Production airplane in 113 days. You think about that. We've been 18 years with the F-22 in frontline fighter service. 113 days. The British came over to us and said, hey, we need help building airplanes. We can't build the Spitfires of hurricanes or typhoons fast enough. Can you build the P-40? Well, the people of the P-40 factory said, no, but we'll let American, North American build the P-40. So the Brits wrote to North America and said, can you build a P-40? They went, no, we can build you a better airplane. And it's taxing in right now. And I was talking with Loco, the F-22 popped two weekends ago. We were down at Columbus Air Force Base in Mississippi where Texan 2 parked right in front of the hangar back there. The office is parked. They got guys came up here last night in their T-6 Texan 2 from Columbus. 
So Michael, what airplanes like to fly? B-51. And he's flying a Raptor. Oh, that's a big one. 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 Oh, that's a